guys. Um, I decided to do this penny haul video before my sisters get here to go through it. I said I have way too much. Come get stuff. Christmas is coming. You can use it for presents. <laughs> Only cost me a penny a piece. So come and get it. Uh, this is about half. Don't mind the mess down here. I am in my basement that is shared between me, my father-in-law when he comes and visits, and my storage. So I have crazy amount of stuff so we'll get to it all and I'll show you guys what all I got so like I said don't mind the mess um, my craft room is over there I'll give you a sneak peek of that but I wanted to come on and show you guys all the stuff I got it is crazy um, if you don't know anything about penny shopping go check out Krista coupons on YouTube there's other people uh, but Krista usually tries to give every all the lists in a timely manner and she lets you know what to do. Don't just go into the Dollar General and ask for penny items. That is like rule number one because the employees do not want to sell them to you. This time the employees did not know to pull these items so actually uh, all the employees were kind of cheering me on every time I found something. <laughs> so that was exciting. Usually they get pretty upset because um, I guess they can get in trouble for not pulling the items. So we'll start right here on the bed. As you can see, I got all kinds of stuff. I got uh, little girls clothes here. I got these uh, copper nonstick pans, some other pans. These are cake pans. I'm gonna go through it fast because there's so much. I don't want the video to take forever. A little dish towel. Um, there's a green dot there. That means it was a penny. This is a red dot. That means that was a penny. These were yellow dot clothes. I never even noticed the little symbols on the tags and still till I started penny shopping um, and now I know and I'm getting pretty good at it uh, last week there was like a surprise penny list in the clearance section and that's how I got some of this stuff um, like these craft supplies which I'm sure me and I'm sure other divers have found in the dumpsters before uh, when they go through their clearance section these were hanging on one of those like little plastic tab things so uh, this was like the only thing I found in this store. It was a late uh, trip. I figured I'd go and see if there was anything left over. And these were hanging in there. They're like little chip clips. Little Lego set. Uh, little kids toys. This bucket is full of keychain knickknacks. Um, little purses. Things like that. It's all sorts of these little... Um, you put whatever you want on there. It comes with little letters. My little purse, little um, glow sticks. I got two cases of these bracelets, which I'm pretty sure I found some of those before as well. This whole basket is full of hair things, um, all these little bows. Well, they say little, they say jumbo bow right on them, but that whole bucket's full of that. Uh, I got a keychain, a power bank, some uh, utensils for the kitchen some uh, can openers oh, I forgot this reflective vest and this is full of like jewelry little bracelets and necklaces and this side is like garden things uh, hose menders and things like that plus this little garden stone and a flag even the bubble wrap was a penny I had five in my cart there was still two more on the shelf that I couldn't get they were on the top shelf um, these are the bigger rolls from there, and I uh, had an elder lady ask me uh, where I found those and how much they were. When I told her they were a penny, she kind of freaked out, but I knew that the ones that were left were too high for her to grab, and I didn't want her having to try and knock it on her head, so I just gave her a couple of mine. And she was pretty excited. She never found a penny at them before, so maybe she'll become a penny shopper. <laughs> I'm not sure, but there were all these um, Swiffer uh, dry cloth things for like the little Swiffer dusters. Um, I think these are for like the broom type ones. All of these dog harnesses. I had more. My sister has a puppy, so I gave her uh, some of those as well as a uh, dog toy. I already gave one to my dog. And this gather sign. It's like one of those metal ones. If you dive at Dollar General, you might have found one of those before. And then this was the thing that I was so excited about, I walked in and I seen those on top and I scanned one and it said a penny. So I grabbed all six of the boxes. Uh, might be greedy. 
but or seem greedy, but I was planning on giving these for Christmas presents to my family. So I got six of those. They're the copper, uh, copper style ones. I'll give you guys a sneak peek of my craft room. It is a disaster because I've been crafting and I've been busy. So I try to keep everything organized. Uh, that's one of the zombies I make. My cricket over there is open. I need to close it. <laughs> And this little thing, some of the crafts I've been making. I made that little one right there. I made that pumpkin. I fixed up that little thing I found a while back. So, I've been crafting. And I try to keep it all organized. You guys can see all the flowers I found. My Halloween corner. Because I love Halloween. Uh, I found that a while back. I found the cover for my Cricut. My Cricut was actually white. I switched it out. Uh, a lot of these are actually dumpster finds. Um, all of these totes here are um, that one I did purchase. That you guys remember me finding a bunch of the stuff I found. Um, there's that tabletop I found like at the beginning of my videos. I still have to put legs on. Like I said my craft table is a mess right now. But I try to keep it organized. Usually it's a mess when I leave it and then I clean up before I start a new craft. And this is one of those mirror frames I found that I changed into that. And this is another frame that I found that I'm going to put in my bathroom once I paint my bathroom. I, uh, it was just a broken mirror in the frame and I uh, put a piece of uh, drop cloth in there and then I um, put the sign on the glass. So I am excited to get that hung up. But anyway, moving on. Uh, this whole like a flower pot I got that there um, all of these socks packs and packs of socks we're all from there so I got socks uh, kids toys lunch box uh, hummingbird feeders silverware sets grill things hats and flip-flops and sandals <laughs> and these are all pens believe it or not all of those are pens. Even all of those are pens. Um, and then this is all clothes. These are baby boy clothes. These are baby girl clothes. I'm excited to give all of these to my sister when she gets here. And these are little boys. Sorry, it seems close up because um, I can't use my flash when I have it on the zoom out version. So... It is a little bit closer than what I normally record. These are all men's shirts. Uh, these two I found in the dumpster a while back. I just have them hanging because my sister's going to come and go through. And then this is all ladies' clothes. So, yeah, t shirts, sweatpants, all kinds of leggings, more sweatpants. Uh, hoodie I was hoping was my size because I really like that hoodie uh, let's see got some dress shirts and things in there and then the guys there's um some like let's see if I can get it without making you guys sick I like the real true brand you see this was a green star and the SS20 right there means spring summer 2020 so since it's going into fall winter, they clearanced them out and then um, they marked them down. And now they were supposed to be pulled to put up the winter clothes and they didn't get pulled. Like they got a, a bunch of the real tree stuff and the little kids stuff. Look at these little outfits for baby. Oh. Now you guys know why I don't record and dive. Look at how terrible this is. This little beautiful outfit. Cute little outfit it says new princess in town. Isn't that cute? So I am excited for my niece to be coming to this world. <laughs> yeah, look at, I'll stand back so you guys can get. That's all clothes. So all of this stuff you guys can see that I've showed you. Um, plus all of 
these pans, all of this cost me about six dollars. If you believe that, <laughs> it's true, six bucks. Um, try to do their surveys if you find penny items, it helps their stores, um, helps them get in less trouble, I guess. But like I said, they weren't told to pull this, so they didn't get in trouble. So they were pretty excited to not have to go through it themselves and pull all these items. Um, and I was happy to take them. I have two of my sisters coming over. I'm going to see about um, a friend of mine coming over and um, my sister-in-laws and stuff like that. Um, I have to put these away before they get here. Although I think I might do a different uh, something for them for Christmas. Um, all right, I'll be right back. So Walmart is clearancing off all their Christmas and fall stuff. Well, or sorry, Halloween and fall. So they have these blankets, the Halloween and the fall style ones like this that hang on the hanger. In the store, they're usually on an end cap, and they're switching them out for the Christmas ones. Well, these are were originally ten dollars. I got them for two fifty. I was hoping they had more, um, especially in the different styles and stuff. But I found three. I have one upstairs already in my living room to go with my fall stuff, and I think. Um, I'm going to give these to my sisters for Christmas. So hopefully they don't watch this video and see. If not, they know what they're getting. they already seen this because I was so excited when I found these. I sent them a picture. And I said, look, ladies, this cost me six cents. <laughs> and they couldn't believe it. So, like I said, they'll be here soon. So I have everything set up for them to go through. It's like a little convenience store. That's what my sister said. She said, Cody's convenience store. <laughs> I'll keep showing you guys and uh hope you like this video it's different than what i normally do um but it's still exciting um cost me almost as much to get this as it does to go diving um if you count gas and things like that uh, and this is all from let's see three different stores i think i found i found almost all the clothes uh, at one store some of the baby clothes i found at a different store and then most of like the accessories and stuff i got from random stores different stores here and there um so yeah if you see any of this download the dollar general app on your phone and start scanning and like i said go check out krista coupons and she will tell you what to look for and you can get stuff for a penny too all right guys i'll see you on the next one bye